Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Caitlin or Blue, and today we have a Valentine's Day special drawing, which I will be posting this within the week of Valentine's Day month. <laughs> Not on Valentine's Day or the week of. Uh, it's going to be sometime in the month of February because I got a lot of drawings. Uh, so anytime in February, I will be posting. And I have no idea when this video will be posted, but yeah. Just thought I'd let everyone know that this is meant for Valentine's Day, which is why it's a boba cup, boba cup with two raccoons inside and little heart tapioca pearls, and the theme is all pink. Well, not the whole theme, because the two raccoons are not pink. Which, um, I'll be talking about the two raccoons in just a second. Well, not just a second, in a little bit. But anyways, this drawing is meant for me and my boyfriend, because I love him. Which this month, y'all probably will hear a lot about him, because it's the month of love. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, anyways, we have this little cup of boba, which is strawberry flavor, of course, because, um, me and my boyfriend both love strawberries, and also the first time that, like, he ever had boba with me, um, like, we had boba together, it was a, a strawberry flavor boba, which I got at a Thai place inside of a mall, which I've always gone there to get my boba, um, and I can't get it anymore because I moved, but that's okay. Um, I haven't had any other boba since. Um, I, whenever I do my visitations, I go and get that boba because I am a fan of that boba. And, like, it's kind of like a slushy boba. It's not like that actual, like, normal boba that you get. It's kind of like a slushy boba, but it's so good and I love it. Uh, well, not, it's not really slushy either. It's kind of like milkshake in a slushy had a baby kind of, but, like, more milkshakey, you know? Yeah, but anyways, like I was saying... The first boba me and my boyfriend drank was a strawberry flavor, and I've been meaning to draw our two raccoon characters together for a while, because, well, I love raccoons, and he does too, so I was like, hmm, let me do this for us, and when is the perfect time to hop onto a drawing of these two together, then the month of love, obviously, um, yeah, yeah. So, um, the reason why I haven't drawn our two raccoon OCs together is because his raccoon never had a design because I never took the time to design one, but I finally got one, and um, <laughs> you'll see the little chibi doodle I did just for the little, the little Berber himself, um, and then I had my boyfriend name him because I was not coming up with any good names, and my boyfriend named him Lumos, which I think was really cute. And I try to design the um, little goober to the best of my abilities where, like, it works out for the character and works out for my boyfriend and how he is. And, yeah. Um, so, eventually, you guys will get to see his um, drawing of what he looks like. Um, honestly, if you guys want to see, like, um, my artwork before it's posted on YouTube, um, if you just go to my Instagram, that's pretty much forecasting the type of videos I'll be coming up. Because I cannot help myself. Like, I literally, as soon as I'm done drawing my artwork, if I haven't already posted that day, I'll be posting. Um, only digitally, though, which I find funny, because I used to work in my sketchbook all the time, and I barely even posted any artwork from it. But um, if I, like, stop doing my digital art grind... Because I have quite a bit of videos ready. Um, then I'll probably post some stuff from my sketchbook. Or what I'll start doing now is posting some from my sketchbook. Doing like maybe two posts today. I don't know. I'm unsure. Maybe I'll just have to do a whole bunch of like sketchbook pages. Like little catch up on my sketchbook with me uh, type of pages. <clears throat> but yeah, I'm just I'm just rambling. Also, sorry if I sound sick. I'm just like getting over it. And I really wanted to do this voiceover. But anyways, I have an old reference sheet of uh, Ramen that I made. And Ramen is my old raccoon OC. And she doesn't happen to have a boyfriend. So I was like, you know what? Let's give her a boyfriend, which will be my boyfriend's raccoon. And I made for him. So yippee! Um, we have his raccoon, which um, mine is named Ramen because she literally lives in a little ramen bowl. That's how she was made. Um... Yeah, she has three different colors in her little color palette, and she's just, she's a little baby to me. I, I just, oh, I love her. She's so pretty. Um, But we'll go more into her, because I also made her a ref sheet. And, um, yeah, I have a few ref sheets for my characters. We're just going to have to wait for me to do a voiceover for all of them, because um, I'm a little slow in that area and wanting to make voiceovers for those. Um, 
But we'll get there eventually. We'll get to all the voiceover bits that uh, I can do, you know. Um, which shouldn't take long. Because... Yeah, it'll probably be, like, I'll probably do voiceovers for my character spreadsheets, maybe for every, like, other, every other week maybe we'll get one posted, um, or once a month we'll try and get a character sheet out to, like, do a meet this character, because I feel like that would be a cute little YouTube idea for all of us. Also, ramen right now looks a little derpy, I apologize, and here I am just fixing up some things because she's a little messed up. That's okay, we still love her. Oh, would you look at that? You can see the little derpy doodle of uh, his character, Lumos. <laughs> but yeah, look at him. He's a little punk dude. I love him. He just, he's just that guy, you know? So yeah, that little doodle uh, made everything happen. And I will eventually make like a full-on ref sheet and post it. Also, I need to use Twitter more. I know this is also random. So anyways, let's talk about uh, the uh, drawing again. So for the topper, I made it a raccoon head because I see a lot of like cute little boba cups and even like boba cup drawings where like there's an animal head top on top of it. And I thought, how cute would it be to have like a little raccoon topper cup with two little raccoons inside who have little heart bobas because, you know, Valentine's Day. And I made it all pink because like it's Valentine's Day themed and like love themed. So I was like, pink. And then the insides are strawberry. I was like, this is all coming together, guys. <laughs> so, yeah, I, d I did that. Um, and to be honest, I made a cup before this one, which, like, completely inspired me to make this. Uh, the cup beforehand was um, a little cow cup for a drawing I did for somebody else, which you guys will eventually see up on my channel because I did film that as well because I have no shame, no gain, you know? Uh, well, I have no shame, all gain, I guess. Um, but yeah, I really, I wanted to do that, and I thought it would be, I thought it would be good. But anyways, I may do a few more Boba Cup drawings, just because I genuinely love these little Boba Cup drawings, and they make me so happy. But instead of, like, drawing the same OCs, it would also, obviously be different OCs, because I want to expand drawings of my characters, because I honestly don't draw my characters enough, and also, I'd love to make, like, different style of Boba cu Animal Cups, and maybe I'll make, like, two animal cups of, like, the same, um, cup. Like, duplicate the drawing that I made and color them, um, and whatnot. And, you know, just, like, duplicate them and, like, get them colored. Maybe I'll do, like, two animal cups of the same drawing, uh, and then, like, do different colorations of, like, the animal. Uh, who knows? But I'll draw one with my OC, and then, like, the other drawing that I duplicated will be with somebody else's OC that I find on Instagram or TikTok, because then, like, I give out more to the art community, which I always take as a big win, because there are so many good artists and so many cool and lovely OCs. I feel like I should just, like, give out to the communi community, and some OCs deserve more attention than what they get, and, yeah, I feel like giving artists art is always such like a big thing for them so yeah i want to do that and i already have like a few ideas like ducks more raccoons some frogs and just etc you know um anyways one thing i wish i added to this drawing was maybe like some actual strawberries being in the cup or like outside of the cup other than that i feel like maybe just adding in some highlights and shading to the drawing could have improved this severely i'm sure of it plus they really it would have just, like, added more colors into it, but, oh, well, you live and you learn, you know? Uh, maybe we'll do that in some future drawings. But, yeah, overall, I'm very happy with the color palette and the way I fit the two raccoons inside of the cup. And I actually drew out two characters together as a even bigger bonus. I made a whole new OC, which, honestly, I don't make new OCs very often because my brain just doesn't work like that very often anymore. Which is sad, but honestly, I have a good amount of OCs anyway, so I'm not too mad about it. And I slowly will design new OCs over time. It's just going to take me a little while. Anyway, here is the beautiful artwork. And it took a great amount of like me like actually pushing myself to draw this. But we got there, um, and I'm glad we did. We did. Glad we did, goodness. Because um, if we didn't, um, I would have been sad. Just a smidgen. But yeah, um... Hopefully you guys like this video. Um, I know I sure did. Also, designing like the pinkish liquid on top of the drawing 
is always so fun to me because I get to figure out like how much I want it to look like they're actually in the drink um which is just like a little fun thing for me to do I guess um but yeah I was super happy just drawing in the little doodles inside of this drawing because I find it like really cute and it's just like a little additive thing for me to do also I posted the speed paint on TikTok which I don't use TikTok as much anymore, but if you guys want to follow it, it's the same thing on all of my um, content that I create. It's all snoozing blue, like my username on here. But yeah, that's the end of the video. So if you've liked it, make sure to give a like and consider subscribing if you want to watch more of my content. And yeah, here's the uh, final drawing. Have a great rest of your day. Goodbye.